I'm Jen Wiederstrom, and I'm from Chicago, Illinois. Getting into fitness was just kind of a natural thing in my household. My parents had both been, you know, coaches at a high school level. We were always just interested in movement. We had like very physical jobs as kids. We all had chores. As a family, grew our own vegetables, so we were like carrying pails of water and we're digging weeds and we're, you know, so. Fitness as a career came much later in my life because I'd always use movement as a way of performance. So I'm gonna work out to do sports and perform better at my sports. So I did college hammer throw, so work out, throw farther. And then I did American Gladiators, so I'm gonna work out so I can be leaner. It was never about health. And then I had this weird time doing a lot of television and extremely hard on my body. Worried my muscles were too big, worried that I wasn't gonna be lean enough. For the first time in my life, I've actually let my body have a say in my fitness goals. I listen to my body. I, I say it in my programs, the only person you should listen to in class over me is your body. It will always talk to you. I call it body talk. So the goal, I guess, would always be listening to my body, number one, but strength forever. That's number two. I wanna be able to help my friends move when I'm 80, right? Like that's just, I gotta have strength. When I transitioned to actually coaching people through fitness, it was like something in me cracked open. And I realized that the impact of, of fitness really is a community thing. It wasn't just about one person doing it by themselves. And I realized my power to influence the course of someone's personal decisions was by kind of helping them get unstuck and consider a different storyline for themselves. I feel like I realized I owe Biggest Loser a lot of gratitude for really honing in what I love doing the most, and that's truly working with beginners. There's just not a lot out there for people that are trying to start. And I know the feeling of being left out. You know, I grew up not a very popular kid, and just visualize with me, think about like junior high and high school, and it's like lunchtime, and you've got your tray, and you don't know what table to sit at. I love working with beginners because I want to create that table that I looked for at lunchtime to sit at with people that would accept me and without judgment and allow me to learn at my pace. And that's what I'm kind of creating in the way I work with people and beginners. I think that this population of beginners is so underserved because it's just not that sexy. You know, you look at what's being promoted and it's all of this crazy, dynamic, high music, da 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 da, -da. But that's, I mean, what, what a small percentage of the population can or would want to live there. I know people that are, after three kids, they're still a size six and they're like, oh, I can't handle that. I need something more my pace. But I think a lot of times people perceive that they're not cool starting at the beginning. And I, I love being a beginner. I've never stopped being a beginner. I'm always learning something. I'm always trying something. So I'm just, I'm bringing that back around. So the thought of partnering with an open fit that's gonna basically, I almost feel like we're the Avengers and we're like becoming this super powered team to really reach people and let what's going on in people's homes and people's situations be the pathway for what we build and create together going forward. I love my program. I don't think I've smiled this big about a program. I'm really great at helping you get unstuck, pulling you out of that conversation that brings in doubt and fear and gets you past those words and into movement. When you stay connected to movement each day, you're gonna make better food decisions, you're gonna sleep better, your stress is gonna be better, and that is this downward slope of weight loss when all those things are happening. So that stuff's gonna happen. The weight loss is the easy part. This is the fun part for me because if I get you on track here, which I will if you stick with me for four weeks, the body will take care of itself. You're gonna feel not only energized, not only more pumped about your life, you are gonna feel what I find is the number one motivating factor of anything and anyone I've ever met, which is pride. When you feel good about what you've done, nothing can motivate you more than that, not even me. But that's what I need you to join for so you can see for yourself.